Mukbang Mermaid Mukbang Mermaid I am Look Long Mermaid And I look long that way wasn't able to today. Give me a second, bubs. <sighs> Nothing like some fresh salt water, I tell you. All right, bubs, put your hands, fans, paws, nubs, whatever you got, put them together. Dear God, it is I, Muck, Mucky, Muck Bond Mermaid, your best friend till the end. The hardest working mermaid with sands. <laughs> and you got today I've never made a quiche. I wonder if it's got any beef inside. It looks pretty creamy. Oh my. Anywho, God, I'm starving like Marvin. And I try not to sin, so I'm about to get it in with my fans. And if Abner doesn't come home later, this is gonna be my den. Dinner, that is. Anywho, God, I love you. Amen. Yeah! You know what time it is, bubs. It's time to get it in. I said, my grace, now I can put this food in its place. <laughs> I'm excited. Bubbles, look at this thing, man. Let me give you a close-up. Uh, let's see. Look at this. Look at what the heck? I've never heard this, Bubbles. Bubbles, have you ever heard quiche? Let's give it a go. But I gotta give it to the man. Now I will never tell him to his face. But he is an amazing chef. I see why other fast food places hire him. The man's a beast in the kitchen. Bubbles, this is delicious. 
It's giving me like a egg custard. And that's mozzarella cheese. I know my cheeses, because I've got to wash the cheese and the beans. I get a little gassy. I'll take the chili. Now our beans in it. I don't know for sure or not. Because I cannot do beans. Those give is me gas. Chili, is it beans and it's chili? Is it beans and it's chili? Oh. I cannot do beans. Is it beans and it's chili? Yep, it's beans and it's chili. Oh, come on. Do they know what kind of beans? Lima beans or what? No, I don't think it, it ain't no lima beans. What kind of beans is it that up? Cause tell her I get gassy and I need to know what kind of beans. They get gassy and they want to know what kind of beans. It's crushed up chili beans. It's, it's crushed up chili beans. Alright, if it's, you know, kind of crushed up fine, I'll try it. Cause I am hungry. And there is no hair on it, right? It's no what? Hair on it, because it's a, a dog, a hot dog. <laughs> Just a little joke. I might be gassy tonight after eating this. Oh, no. Oh, well, scoot over, Abner. I mean, he put a lot of cheese in this. And that crust is so flaky. Now, I'm not eating this crust. I don't like the crust. Do you like the crust bubbles? Give me a second. Mm. Um. Oh my word. Mm. He's got onions caramelized and bacon in this. <sighs> oh, Abner. One slice just isn't going to do. That's good. And he kind of caramelized the top. Oh, that's good. Rebels! Today is the... What's the month you guys call it? November. Yes, because... Oh, my word. The other day there were so many kids knocking on the door. Kind of made me think of last year. When I had a friend, Mr. Alien, do you remember? And the weirdest thing is, the day before, I accidentally called a psychic line. And she told me, she told me that I would be meeting a friend on that Halloween day. Hello? Hello. This is Fortunes by Cookie. I had a missed call from this number. I do apologize as I was in a deep slumber. Yeah, I was trying to get my fans on some fortune cookies. <laughs> uh, they're so sweet and crunchy. Well, when you don't get a stale one, and it's hard to crack it open. Is it your fortune you're looking for, darling? Hurry, tell me. I do not like starling. My fortune? <laughs> You mean that little piece of paper that's inside the cookie that always gets in the way? Ugh. Yeah, I can't read that, so I usually just eat it. Darling, I see that you're lonely, but that won't last much longer. You see, a guest from out of this world is headed your way, looking for a place to lay. You're a different type, my dear. You're quite hard to tame. But very soon, I see lots of money and worldwide fame. Enjoy the moments, darling. The wheel of fortune will forever roll in your favor. Could I be wrong to sense you're eating Baskin Robbins ice cream? 31 flavors. Your guests will arrive on a stormy night when the streets will be filled with terror and fright. 
you'll be handing out the candy. I'm seeing Mike and Ike's. Whatever you do, do not fear, my dear. Your new guest will be quite sincere. He'll actually become your new friend, my dear. He'll bring you adventure, laughter, and cheer. Well, I must get going, darling. But whatever you do, remember your life is up to you. And then, like, a few days later, that creature's here. Track there. Oh, and I'll tell you, Abby and I went out yesterday. We went out to eat together for the first time. He said no one would look at me. And I was like, excuse me, Abner, just because we're married doesn't mean other men cannot look at me, okay? They just can't touch. And he was like, no, no, that's not what I'm talking about. Look at you. When you look in the mirror, what do you see? That's what everyone else is seeing. They'll judge you and we'll get kicked out. And I said, oh, yeah, they'll call those three numbers, 911, blah, blah, blah. I tell you, I get sick of people judging me. And I'm getting sick of staying in this house all the time. I got to think of something. And I got to think of it fast. Anywho, bubs, back to eating. Hey, what are you doing for Thanksgiving? Thanksgiving. Um, Abner sure can do a mean pot of greens though. Remember that soul food dinner? I 
What do you normally prepare, Pebbles? This is so creamy and good. He used the uh, thick cut bacon. I can feel it. And those eggs are so creamy. I mean, how do you make this thing? How did he make this? Mmm. Oh, that's good. Like I said, I don't like the crust. He could have took the crust off. That's what he could have did. The crust just has a different flavor to me. I'm sorry. Let me get that egg off. Have a bite? No, you prefer your eggs sunny side up? I understand. Looks like a, a cobweb. Try it. And that, my bubbles, is how you devour a queef. Queef. Quince. Quince. A quiche. That is how you devour a quiche. That was good. I wonder what I should tell Abner. Eh, uh, it was okay. Needed a little more salt for my liking. No, no, no. Uh, I prefer my eggs a little harder cooked, Abner. But it was okay. Uh, maybe I'll just be honest. Abner, it was pretty good. I'll be honest. It was pretty good, I tell you. You surprise me every time. Now, don't go get in the big head because your head's big enough. You can barely fit a hat now. Uh, anywho, Bubbles, if you would, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and uh, we'll do it again. I love you. I got to think about what I want Abner to cook for Thanksgiving also. Yeah, it'll be here before you know it. Huh. Now let me go see if there's any more quiche in the fridge. Yeah, yeah, and now, like I said, uh, it was okay. Needs a little more socks for my liking. And did you put any herbs in it? I told you, man, you need to get more veggies in your diet. Mm -hmm.